Hello everyone, welcome back to my new video tutorial Tinker Cat Circus. In this, we're gonna learn how small circuits and larger circuits and programmable circuit works, and we can simulate the circuits we make. So let's start. So don't forget to subscribe and like my videos. So the first thing we're gonna do is click on circuits. You can go to the link called tinkercat.com. You have to log into your Gmail ID and password. If you don't have, just go for a sign up and you can sign up for the Tinkercad circuits. Let's let me uh, explain you the basics of Tinkercad. It's all about circuit designing. It's all about basic learning circuits. So I'm going to create a new circuit just to demonstrate you. Click on create new circuit button. It will show you a workspace where you can drag and drop things to get connected. So here. In this part, we first will be first learning the basic components, and there are lots of components from Arduino and circuit assemblies too. So initially, we will be learning basic circuits. So I'm gonna drag one LED here, like this. It is a useless one. So this LED has two links. I know that it's positive and cathode is negative. If I connect a battery to it, I'm gonna drag the battery here, and now two positive and cathode to negative guess what happens what happens here if i'm gonna start the simulation it bursts because it do have lots of current value so i can register the current with the help of a register let's stop the simulation and connect a register instead of the negative pole i'm gonna connect the register here let's zoom out a bit and again i can connect to this negative terminal and let's see what happens start the simulation yippee the bulb glows yes the bulb glows now the next task i'm going to do to put a switch in between it's very simple it's drag and drop i'm clicking here see so when i start the simulation you can see if i click it the bulb will glow so this is the basic circuit explanation we'll be making lots of more videos to explain lots of different components including sensors actuators and programmable circuit boards even i will i'll explain you how to code on the tinkercad circuits so this is the basic explanation if you uh, like my if you like my video just click on like button and don't forget to subscribe it so thank you for watching we'll be updating you soon